What in the world? What in the world? What in the world? I, um, so did we know? Did we know we were getting two videos in less than a week for Indigo? Did we know this? I didn't know this, but in the ocean, in the ocean of what BTS and ARMY are experiencing in 2022, I have been very lost at sea. Not being super active on Twitter means I also miss out on information. So we, we knew Indigo was coming. We knew Wildflower was coming. We had the teaser for Wildflower and the teaser like appropriately came out and then told us that the video would come out a few days later. Don't videos always drop at Thursday night at midnight Eastern time? I'm not trying to be dramatic here, but is anybody else just like in this ocean, this ocean, this. All I know is I woke up, I messaged somebody a quote from Nam June's DJing on Station Head in the middle of the night, his quote of, that's all right because I'm 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 worse. I'm the worst at um you know chewing the bubble gums. No seriously guys, I'm I'm I can make bubble gums. I thought it was such a cute quote, and then immediately hit with the notification that there was a teaser for a video for Still Life. We're finding out there's gonna be a second video. It's Tuesday. The video will come out on Thursday night. I didn't watch the teaser yet. <laughs> I had to get to therapy. I just get in the car, I go to therapy, and I walk out of therapy and check my phone, and the video has already dropped. Like, we had like two hour warning. Am I the only one? If I'm the only one who did not know this video was coming, well, then I sound absolutely over the top right now. <laughs> and I'm so eager to watch it. Okay, I'm gonna calm down. Oh my God. I can't believe there's a video. Maybe the rest of you did have notification. I did not. I did not know that this was coming. <laughs> Oh my God. How did he and Anderson Pock meet? Did, did they meet? Was it in Vegas when they met? Do we know? Because of course, while they were in Vegas, Anderson Pock played drums for their yet to come performance. And it seems not likely, right? That they met and spoke for the first time in Vegas and decided to go ahead and like, hey, let's just play drums and film it together too. But then again, while they are immaculately planned out and organized, they also are very fascinating and jump on opportunity because you kind of have to. I would love more of that story. I'm such a nosy Nancy. I really want to, I want to know everything. I want to know who Nam Jun was thinking about when he wrote different songs on Indigo. I want to know how he met Anderson Puck. I want to know, like, <laughs> I, I, I want to know, I want to know. Inquiring minds want to know. I want to know. I want to know. And yet I really want to respect their privacy and the fact that that I'm supposed to be living my own life instead of just swimming in theirs. Lord, let's just hit play and calm down. That is irony. Hit play and calm down. The song is so much fun. And again, if you have not listened to Indigo on earbuds as an army, I plead with you. I plead with you, please wear earbuds as soon as you can to take in any of their music. Jack in the Box is superb with earbuds. All of the discography is superb. Certain songs on Indigo are mind-blowingly good with earphones on. Still Life is one of them. <laughs> I'm already. I don't need captions. I don't need captions. Turn them off. Train. We have I want to hit pause already. We have trains all throughout discography of. I'm still Whoa. Whoa. That's I'm weird. Still oh my God. He's so beautiful. I'm still we also have Nam Jin with his paper cup I'm still throughout discography. Whoa! I love that line. No name because I'm untitled. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Life is better than death, I'll prove it. 
样的窗户，都比我奶高处。I'm still alive, but I'm moving. Hot damn, he's so beautiful. Whoa! <laughs> This is such a mind trip. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> However, no, Ryan, I'm not gonna say it. Whoa! I want to hit pause. Sorry, I always hit pause my second go round. Patience. Whoa! Ah! This reminds me of that commercial. Wasn't there like a? Was it a? Who was it for? Was it for Samsung earbuds? The girl dancing in the train? With BTS and the... Anyway. Oh my god! I can't help but think about um, yet to come Busan them in the train and how emotional that was. Sorry. Why is this making me cry? Because everything makes me cry when it comes to BTS. We are going to watch that again. I'm going to try really hard not to choke up and cry. I'm, I'm, I'm having a really hard time believing that being alive is better than being dead. And so I'm really, I'm grabbing hold of the lyrics and I'm trying really hard just to hold on to them as hope that that I will prove that and that I'll see and be inspired by other people who are proving that right now, that it's, that life is better, still alive is better. His album really tops and tops, touches into like the monotony of constantly going and holding on to hope for like what the magic is. And I'm so proud of Namjoon. I haven't cried about that yet. I haven't. Oh, sorry. Another Trisha Paytas moment here. I'm so wildly proud of him and he may say that he's no villain no hero he's no name but he's a part of this like crazy beautiful tapestry of life which is why i am holding on and trying to believe really trying to believe that life is better than death and he creates this beauty and this passion and this fun even when he's tired even when he is trying to grasp hold of that hope and he worked so hard to really put his heart into into his band, his brothers, and also like into himself. He's doing the work, refusing to believe that like the best days are behind him. He is choosing to believe that the best is yet to come. And he's looked for people who inspired him, you know, the artist Yoon and all the artists he chose and worked with on his album. And we have Wildflower, which is so passionate. And like the video just shows so much passion and determination and surrender. And then you have Still Life where he chose to share this really fun approach to art and creation, which the entire song is that vibe. I love the part where Anderson Pac and Namjoon are, are talking back and forth. And again, this this is one of the songs on Indigo that is so much more powerful with earbuds than, than just hearing it over your TV screen or your YouTube screen. <sighs> It's such a flood. Oh my God, I hear notifications on my phone and I start to panic because it's like, <laughs> so much is dropping. So many visual things, so many bong ton bombs, so many choreographies and they're sharing their own lives, sharing and shaping that way. Okay, we just need, um, let's do this one more time. If only he had a lollipop, a sucker, and dropped it in. Sorry, I'm... One of my, you know, first fall in love with the BU concept was with Run and I Need You. I'm still oh! <laughs> I'm still Wait. I'm already backing up. I'm still I'm still I was looking at his reflection that time. He has got the sweetest face. 
<laughs> I like. Oh my god. In this. This digital world. Son of a bitch, my heat just turned on. Please ignore it. I'm sorry, be patient with me. I did not know there'd be another song video. I love it's a song about still life and everything's still moving. It's like the art. I also love I'm not I don't finish sentences I'm sorry so sorry about the heater so he's utilized like digital image and a very three-dimensional vibe because he's very into sculpture Oh, I've got to pause on this. She's lovely. She's lovely. I love her. <laughs> oh, I love that. I love that it's water stained on top of everything else there. It's there's I'm it's weird that I'm like just freeze framing on this cuz it's Woo! That scene! Look at that! Look at him! Look at him! Look how sly! Look how sly his reflection face is. <laughs> Sorry. Look at this! It's like little devilish, almost like Jimin does a little devilish smile of I'm. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, he's just jamming. He's just vibing. Oh my god. Oh my god, his face, his skin. I know, I'm sorry. It sounds crazy like I'm obsessing over like the visuals. I'm so sorry about my friggin' furnace. I never leave my furnace on. I'm so sorry about that. I'm also really emotional watching this, and I'll keep this short here, but I'm really emotional watching this because this is the way we want Namjoon to be able to look at life, right? Like, to be able to ride a train comfortably, take the public transportation he loves to take, to take in scenes on life. Like, it's magic, right? I've talked about that before. I've talked about that with people love. When I'm in a good place, and when I think back on my memories, everything is technicolor and sparkly with fantasy images around me it's like i have hallucinations and that's how i want to live my life that sort of magic that sort of feeling that i can see how we're connected so i've seen from i heart huckabees right where mark Wahlberg realizes he he's made of atoms and as the atoms are splitting apart where does he end and the person he's reaching for begin like have I gotten too cryptic here? Am I going to like, but this video embodies so much of that. And you know, we just got wildflower where we see Namjoon wrangling with the tortured artist aspect of himself, both vocalized and yet been pent up for a decade and looking for that peace, that groundedness and that beauty from the storm. And then we turn around and we have still life we like want him to be able to dance through the train and like like that that where you feel like you're alone right where you feel like you're in a movie you feel like do you know what i'm talking about am i crazy like this is that's the life that i want that's the life that i want for him that's the life i want for the guys i am so tired of feeling alone and caged and to find out that they've been feeling lonely and caged oh my god 
I, I'm sorry, I'm yelling at you. I'm yelling at you and I did not, I did not mean for that to be my reaction to this video and song and I did not mean for my furnace to kick on. I always go turn that off before I start. Tell me how you're feeling about Indigo, still life. What is yet to come? Oh my gosh. I'll be back in the next day or two. <laughs> um, I, I still haven't figured out if I'm gonna drop the full album release here on YouTube or if I'm gonna put that over on the Patreon. Anyway, God loves you. I love you. BTS loves you. Namjoon loves you. Love yourself. I'll talk to you soon.